uh, the first shot was uh, when uh, that scene cousin hai wala scene when i am drinking water i have to walk that was my first day uh, well uh, with bhumi uh, i call her mimi with her i had to bond because our chemistry had to be super amazing on screen so we had to be like we had to share that bond beforehand because this role is uh, was a challenging one and uh, i took it as a challenge and i i think i would like to believe that i i performed well Hi Chum it's lovely to have you on the quint Hi thank you so much for having me I want to say uh, straight off that I really loved the film Badai Do and I totally loved your performance um thank you especially you know having so many seasoned actors with you uh you still uh, stood out uh, thank you so much <laughs> from what I know about you um you won several beauty pageants um Miss Earth Northeast Diva. There's a long list. I I, I uh, can't even <laughs> stop counting how many there were. You also run a cafe uh, in Pasi Ghat, uh, one of the oldest towns in Arunachal Pradesh, where you're from. When did you move to Bombay, and how has your journey been uh, till you signed on for Badai Do? Uh, I came to Bombay in 2018 uh, July, and uh, the journey till now has been amazing. Like after Badai Do, it's a whole different story i did not expect uh, that the the response would be this this good and it's been amazing i'm blessed i feel blessed tell us about your selection for badai do what was the process like from what i heard you did go for an audition uh, yes uh, so the audition happened uh, in 2020 march and uh, the ad- uh, during the advent of corona and uh, i went to the casting station for my audition and uh, there were this uh, fakira swami and uh, ashish khare and uh, uh, shiv chohan they took my audition and they were so comfortable i was made to feel comfortable during the audition and that happened and they called me again i went there again and then uh, i did one more audition with in front of harsh sir and i think that was when i was locked for the character what was the audition like? was it a scene from the film or was it a generic scene it it was a scene uh, the scene where i uh, fight i have a little banter with bhumi that scene where i have like i had to shout and i was uh, angry at her that scene from the film and what was your reaction when you finally knew that you had got this film i I am a person um I feel a lot inside but I'm not very expressive so I was happy but I couldn't show it but I was like super super happy I, because I knew that this this film is going to change my life for better okay and what was the reaction back home um did they know about it and uh, were there any apprehensions that you were playing a lesbian uh they no they were they were super super excited because nobody from home from my my place uh, has ever done something like this so they were super super happy and apprehensions are uh, no none okay That's i was just happy point. that i because this role is uh, was a challenging one and uh, i took it as a challenge and i i think i would like to believe that i i performed well of did justice to the character <laughs> of course you did um i want to know uh, did you prep for the character i'm sure you had rehearsals and all but did you personally prep for the character in any sort of way um i used to watch films like uh, i used to watch people because i also have uh, a lot of friends from this community so i would uh, be with them and uh, i also had a workshop done uh, before the film with uh, sir sashi bhushan that i think helped me a lot which was the first scene that you shot for um and what was your level of nervousness or excitement uh, the first shot was uh, when uh, that scene cousin hai wala scene when uh-huh. i'm drinking water i have to walk that was my first day 
<laughs> okay, okay, okay. And uh, how was your equation with Rajkumar and Bhumi? Did you get off with any particular actor more than the other? Well, uh, with Bhumi, uh, I call her Mimi. With her, I had to bond because our chemistry had to be super amazing on screen. So we had to be like we had to share that bond beforehand. So I traveled four days before before the shoot started, and that's how we bonded. She was so comfortable to be with, and even Raj, every single person on set, they they didn't make me feel like a, a newcomer. They were super professional, uh, profession, and uh, I think yeah, that's that's how like it reflects in their actions and behavior and how amazing human beings they are. So I saw this uh, picture of you when I was scrolling through your Twitter timeline, where you're holding this placard saying "I'm an Indian uh, at the gateway of India." Could you tell us the story behind that photograph? Yeah, when I first because uh, before this I was in Delhi and. Uh, I, me as a person, I never. It was my first time there in Delhi, and I was used to being at home at Arunachal, and uh, never did I face any kind of discrimination because I was always home. And uh, I went to Delhi, and it was slightly different uh, the response. And then I came to Bombay, and um, I went to this mall. This was in two thousand eighteen, and uh, people were calling me names so i was like i was i thought ki and i was younger then in 2018 so i thought i i have to do something i have to voice my thoughts so i went there and did that i don't know why but i don't have any regrets okay. because after after i shared that post there were so many comments if you go and check and there were so so many comments but people were also calling me name, names again they were like why are you doing this stunt? Is that that was not a stunt, but it's okay if you call it that. But I wanted to be heard, and I did that, and I was heard because uh, it was on uh, newspapers and oh. other platforms. Yeah, this whole um, topic of inclusivity and diversity—it's being taken very seriously in the West. You know, mm -hmm. uh, whether it's films or shows. While here in Bombay, we are still sort of taking baby steps towards it. What are the kind of difficulties, if any, that you feel when it comes to being selected for ads or films or shows? So yeah, um, it's it's not just for us. It's like a general thing because uh, uh, people from all over the country they travel to Bombay to try their luck, and uh, unfortunately, some some sustain, some go back to their respective home states. So I think um, now uh, things are happening like. It's changing. Ex acceptance is there, I would believe. But I know has released, it's got great reviews. Uh, what are the kind of reactions that you have been personally getting? There's so many story mentions, comments that like following up has been difficult. I did not like, I didn't think that it would be, the, I would be receiving so much love. So, so positive, not even single comment or um, message like is negative. And the best response till the date has been like I was told back home that the theaters were full for three consecutive days. Wow! Which made me super happy. Yeah, even Monday it was like uh, because Monday usually people don't go and watch movies, but even on Monday it was like seventy percent booked. That's lovely to hear. Uh, Any reactions from the industry? that you've heard from Harsh or Rajkumar or Bhumi or anybody you're in touch with? Harsh said to, like, uh, when we were shooting, like, uh, he he was, like, super happy then. And, like, his reaction didn't change, Abhita. He's happy. I think he's super, super happy with me. Because uh, he he was, it was clear from his side what he wanted. And I listened to him and I portrayed what he wanted so I think he's like super happy and Raj Raj also told me he uh, texted me the other day he said he more to come this that and Bhumi also is happy she also posted some pictures of us queer love stories are so rare in Bollywood especially mainstream Bollywood um, so what's the reaction been like from the LGBTQ community if you have got any on social media or personally they are loving it. 
So my manager is, uh, he, he also is from the community. And first screening, we went together to watch the film. And uh, he came out of the theater after the film. And uh, he told me that that coming out part where Raj comes out like of the closer. So he was, he said ki he cried. And he also had a friend with him, Shahrukh. So both of them were super emotional and they went to Raj and Bhumi and they thanked them for doing justice to the film, to the characters. So I think uh, everyone is happy and we have uh, reached the target. I mean, they are happy. So what can I say? No, no, absolutely. I, I saw the film in theaters um, over the weekend and people were laughing through the comedy scenes. People were crying, um, especially the Rajkumar scene and also during that uh, parade uh, scene. Yeah, uh, I had goosebumps. Right, right, right. That was so well done. It was absolutely brilliant. I'm so proud that I am a part of, the, like, I'm a part of this film. I, I'm like so, so proud. Okay. Thank, thank God this was my first. <laughs> So, uh, Chum, tell me, how has life changed after Badai, though, if it has? Has there been more calls? I'm sure you're getting a lot of DMs on Insta and a lot of messages on social media. But generally, how has life changed for you? Uh, to uh, like, be honest, I, I'm so busy now. And I, like, so many interviews are lined up. And I'm, because I have not done this before, I'm nervous also. And... Uh, super happy like I'm content in my heart my heart is happy and uh, the other thing is because the response is so good so I have planned this screening back at home so I'm traveling with my sir Harsh, Harsh sir and uh, co-directors and the writers of the film there are nine of us we are going home to Arunachal and we have this small screening there with uh, our, my family and friends and other VIP great great um, you know, I'm very curious about the cafe uh, that you have in Pasigat. So if I ever go there, what's what's the one thing I should have from the menu? Um, because uh, our menu keeps on changing, but um, I don't know. <laughs> everything, everything is good. Uh, but I think you should try our momo. Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> we'll do <laughs> Thanks a lot for talking to us, Chum, and all the best for everything that you do ahead. Thank you so much. Thank you.